Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Nick Pettis, and I'm joined by Dr. Michelle Weber, Kayla Lewis, Victor Ortiz, and Jacob Cruz. And back to Talent Talks. This is season two, everybody. <laughs> I gotta make my own fun, people. So, welcome back to Talent Talks and back to campus. It's been a minute since we've been back to campus. Hope you all are having a good semester so far, and I look forward to joining you guys. So let's find out a little bit about ourselves. Let's start with Kayla. Hi, everybody. I'm Kayla Lewis, um, and I'm super excited to uh, be a part of Talon this year. Uh, this is my third year at MSJC. I started out as a math major. I wanted to uh, get into teaching, uh, become uh, a professor uh, like Dr. Weber, actually. Um, and honestly, math just got kind of boring. Who knew? <laughs> so um, I decided to uh, follow something that's been more of a passion for me, which is writing. Um, and the journalism uh, program just started this year. And so, I, you know, it's it's a good fit for me. Uh, so I'm really excited to get started with that and see where it takes me. Um, I love um, writing about um, other people and their stories. You know, I think there's something that happens in every person's life um, that is worthy of being documented and being told because, you know, at the end of the day, we're all human. And, you know, what is a more universal element for communication than humanity? Um, so... If you see me around campus and you've got a story to tell, um, I do articles and poetry, and I would love to uh, have the chance to tell your story. Um, so if you like to do that, uh, hit me up and uh, we can maybe even get you in the paper. Uh, so uh, that's it for me. And now I'm gonna go ahead and turn it over to Victor. Thank you, Kayla. Um, I'm Victor. Um, so Good evening, everyone. I hope everyone's enjoying the nice weather on this nice Thursday afternoon. It's definitely an, uh, a change in pace. Um, I'm actually not used to this kind of weather. I'm, I've actually recently moved to, um, well, it's been about a, a little over a year, so I still consider that recent. So I'm still getting used to all the four seasons that you guys get here. Um, just a little bit of a background for me. I'm a military brat. I grew up in the military, so I grew up everywhere. I was born in Philadelphia, uh, Pennsylvania, which is a city of brotherly love and where it all started. Um, but um, at any rate, I just jo I joined the Talon because I would really like to um, take my career next into journalism. I've always enjoyed writing. I've always had an aspiration to write a novel. Um, which has become a little bit of a challenge here. Hopefully some of the classes that I'm taking, particularly in media, will help me with that. Um, um, ac uh, so academically, that's what I'm doing right now. Um, before this, I, my previous life, um, I had a, a career in operations management, but I decided I really didn't like that, uh, particularly in healthcare. Um, one of those people that, well, try to fix everything, but um, you just realize that you can't really fix everything. Um, you try to fix on a small scale and then just go from there. Um, but at any rate, um, uh, I'm a vegetarian. I believe in, uh, I don't eat animals. Um, so if you just happen to see me and you want to talk about that, that'd be great. If you want to talk about some other things, that'd be great too. I don't have any specific area that I am focused on with my writing. Um, I'm open to writing pretty much anything. Um, I haven't quite found my niche um, with wherever I, uh, where I would like to focus. Um, but if you happen to see me, um, I'd be more than open to speaking to you about whatever story ideas you might have, or uh, maybe uh, point you in a in a direction of um, one of my other colleagues where they are more focused on that particular subject or whatever. Anyway, uh, thank you everyone um, for listening to my to my, um, to my introduction. And I hope to have a fruitful semester just like I hope everyone else is having a fruitful semester. Um, anyway, thank you, Jacob. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Victor. You know, I don't understand how anyone expects me to be able to top any of the two introductions that came before me. Um, it's gonna be an impossible task. 
Um, I'm never good at this whole introduce yourself thing because, you know, there's only there's so much that goes into being who you are. It's almost impossible to bring that down into two sentences or so. And I'm always I'm, I'm never that good at articulating myself that well on the spot. Um, but my name is Jake Cruz. Uh, I tend to ramble like I just did just then when I don't have my thoughts all put together. Um, you might have already seen me in some of the content in the last few weeks since we started School Up. We, me and Nick, we've been working on some uh, movie related content, which is really going to be a lot of what I do here at The Talent because movies are really my life. Um, I am majoring in digital media, movies, film. I don't know exactly what the path is called, but that's the idea of film and digital media. And more specifically, I like editing. I love working on the software, on the system, seeing how you tweak things to make certain things come out well. Um, I'm just all about that vibe. Um, I'm glad to share this group with you. And why not the rest of you who aren't in the town why don't you join us? We have some wonderful content. If you don't mind, I just wanted to sort of tell everyone about um, what our community is like and also the journalism program, which Kayla mentioned, um, which I, something that I'm really proud of that it started this year and something that I worked really hard on creating over the past four years. So, so um, we do have a new journalism associate's degree for transfer. Um, when I started being advisor for the Talon, we realized that it was something that students were interested in, but we didn't have any degree programs that, that led in that direction. Our communication programs, more human communication. So when I was hired, they asked me to put together the degree program. And so I wrote all the curriculum um, and it's still something that's in process, but it's definitely going um, and we should have our first graduates in May, which is really exciting. Um, the classes that you get to take with this are public relations, uh, media survey course, news writing, and then a practicum class. And then there's a lot of other different choices that you can kind of mix and match depending on what your um, style is or sort of what type of writing. So you could take a poli-sci class if you're going into politics, um, those types of things. The Talon is our student, used to be paper, but we don't really have paper papers anymore um, because we haven't been on campus due to COVID-19. But we did switch to digital and now we're the Talon Student News. Um, and most of you probably know, uh, newspapers are something that is going out of style. There's not a whole lot of paper papers that exist any more people that read them. So digital is where it's at, which is why we need cool people like Jake to create content so that it's something that you wanna watch and see. So we have all kinds of things that we do with our website from video interviews to writing to poetry like Kayla's interested in doing. And Cynthia, Cynthia has done some really cool stuff with us in doing some actual writing. We have photography, we have social media openings, um, just about everything that you need to know in order to get into the field, whether it be public relations or journalism or some other type of field. Um, Cindy, who was our editor in chief last semester is actually a biology major and said that the talent has just helped her to be able to learn how to publicize and communicate and, and those types of things. Before that, it was an English major that we had who was in charge. Now we've got Nick, who's a digital media film and TV. Did I get that right? Yes, you did. Major. Um, so we've got all kinds of people. Um, so you do not have to be a journalism or a communication major to join us. Probably the best thing about the talent is the people. Um, it's not just producing news or producing content, it's the people and allowing their voices to be heard. And that's one of the key things that I like to stress about the talent is if you feel like you're voiceless, this is a place that can give you a voice, can give other people around you a voice. And 
it is also a place for support um, and encouragement and just good vibes, uh, especially in the middle of COVID-19. We have a very robust Discord server and Zoom meetings. We have game nights and we just really enjoy each other's company and build each other up. So anyways, I know I talked for a really long time, <laughs> but the talent is something that's really important to me as is the journalism program. So thanks for letting me share, Nick. Thank you, Dr. Weber. And if you guys are interested in joining the journalism program, I believe that Dr. Weber mentioned that we published some of your guys' works. So it's actually a cool thing. So you guys can join us and you can use your classwork to be promoted on our website. So if that's not any reason to join, I don't know what is. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, and have a good night.